How do you ladies feel? Great. Great. Yeah, I feel I that feel was great. But I'm looking tired. I feel shot and just wa and I just watched you. <laughs> so you did. You ladies did a lot of things. You did. Um, you did. What'd you do? You did stretching. So yeah. we started with dynamic stretching again, just to warm up our bodies, avoid any injury, because what we do in the ladder is a lot of movement, a lot of energy, a lot of strain on the knees, a lot of strain on the knees. Okay. Uh, so obviously, warm up your muscles always. That's something we learned the hard way. Yeah. Because we used to never do it. Yeah. Uh, after the stretching, I never stretch. Yeah. Never stretch. I'm, I'm, I'm due for an injury. Yeah, I'm due for an injury. I don't know. I've been working out for 20 years. Never stretched. <laughs> so yeah, like I said before, we learned the hard way. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, a lot of injuries, sprained ankles, pulled my groin. Wow. So, trying to avoid that, obviously, and yeah. we're not getting any younger. So. Yep. <laughs> amen. Amen to that. Amen to that. Um, after the dynamic stretching, we went on to kind of a ladder workout. Okay. A little bit of cardio. A lot of, of hit. Yeah. Um, and again, the reason primarily why we do this, uh, both of us went to college and played ball. Uh, we don't do that anymore. So, one, just to keep myself happy and, you know, the lifestyle, the soccer lifestyle, obviously I need to be. I'm not a fan of running, so this is the way I've been doing my Neither training. am I. I hate running. Yeah, no. So, obviously, soccer consists of a lot of running, a lot of endurance, a lot of stamina, a lot of recovery. I've heard that soccer players, because they run so much, their hearts are so strong that they never die of heart attack. Thank you, Lord. Can I tell you a weird story? Huh? I'll tell you a weird story. Okay. I went to the doctor. Okay. And I got, like, shocked or something, so I was testing. Okay. And I basically, I guess, because I didn't eat. Oh, wow. And the guy was like, do you run? He was like checking my heartbeat. He was like, yeah, you're fine. I'm like, oh. Because I'm like. Because your heart rate is so low because you run. But it's like, I guess because of the stamina and the dirt that we endure. Yeah. It helped with the fact that I was like not feeling well. Yeah, wow. But. Okay. I, I literally think that like athletes like you ladies, you guys don't die. Like something has to take you. Like something has to kill you. You're not, you're not just going to die of like. Speak that into yeah. <laughs> I really no, I really believe that. It's definitely not the same as it was when we used to play in college. Hence why we do this. Okay. And where'd you ladies go to college again? NASA and O West. Oh Westbury? Okay. I went to NASA and then Blue West. Nassau is like the Harvard of two-year schools. Yeah. I went to Northeastern, right, and came home, and I needed two more classes to graduate, and I took an Excel spreadsheet class at Nassau. Yeah. Beat me down. Yeah. Yep. They beat me Nassau, down. I love, I love Nassau. Nassau's no joke. That's low key where I met her. I met her. Nassau's no joke. I knew the president of Nassau. Oh, yeah. That's a, that's a whole other different that's the story. Um, um, yeah, so. We do it to like prevent injuries. So, and, and, and you ladies are so healthy, and you're like, you, do you feel confident after you do this? Because I think your confidence translates to the boardroom. Yeah, that dude is a monster. That dude is a monster. Yeah. After working out, whether it's the gym, whether it's doing this, I feel like a monster. I have to stop. Yeah. So I don't think there's any way you could do what you just did and be overweight. So for like diabetes, for high blood pressure, yeah, I, I think this is the I cure for it. Meal plan, yeah. and not eat, you know, it's always all balanced. Yes. They always say 80% diet, 20%. Right? 20%, yeah, yeah, diet is everything. But I think even if you have a bad diet and yeah. do what you just did, yeah. it's going to burn it off. Can you like zoom into my face? Let me say that. <laughs> 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 she said 80% diet, and I'm like... Are you not? Are you not a good diet? You, do you like cheat? I cheat all the time. It's balanced. It's balanced. And can I be completely honest? Yes. With you? Um, at least this is my goal. This is why I go somewhere and I'm gym. This is why I play soccer so much. One, the love of the game, obviously, and to stay fit. But I love food. I love food. I love food. And 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 I love food. Y'all are all muscle. Whatever I want. Whatever you want. Whatever I want. Which I, makes me happy. Ultimately, that's my goal to be happy. Yeah. Um, if you're doing it and you're happy, that's it. So the, I think the major takeaway is that you can potentially eat not clean every day and do this and still be. I don't know. Not 
Okay. Not about every day, but again, there's a balance. Uh, yeah, yeah. Weekends, I have my cheat meals. During the, the weekdays, I go wandering. Like pizza? Do you cheat meal with pizza? Oh, yeah. They, do you notice that they only correct me to put my mask on? They have not told you, ladies. <laughs> do you notice that they're all over me? They're all over me. You know? <laughs> yeah, he didn't see it. He didn't see it. Yeah. He's like, he's not paying attention to you. Like, you guys can do whatever you want. <laughs> all right. All right, awesome. So Dana and Samantha, and 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 uh, Samantha's got the ink. That was the no, Dana. Dana. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Forgive me. Her ink is pretty dope. I'm gonna focus in on your on your tab. So what is that? Uh, it's an incorporation of a bunch of things. I'm from Guatemala. Okay. So this metal is cool. the Mayan, you know, the Mayan ruins, Antigua, the lake. The Mayan ruins? Yep. Yeah. Are we focusing on that? Yeah, of course. It's called Tikal. Hold on, let me focus on that. It's still blurry. I don't know why it's blurry. Okay, I see it now. Cool. That's really nice. Uh, this is my mom's eye. A family of four in the middle. That's your mother's eye? My mom's eye. So. Okay. There's a family of four in the middle. My favorite flower. What is that flower? A lotus. Cool. So the lotus, I don't know if you guys know. It actually grows in mud water. Okay. So, it, and it grows to be the most beautiful flower. The mud water, the mud, what mud is it? Water. The mud water flower is pretty dope. And then uh, thyme, which is the most valuable thing to me. You know, time is the, that's interesting, because in the book, I have a whole chapter dedicated towards time. Most and um, yeah. it's, the, it's the most valuable commodity. Yeah. Especially, I think, now, today. Uh, yeah. Quarantine. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. All right, so I really enjoyed the time we spent together, ladies. Thank you so much. So we're going to do a number of episodes, yeah. and we're going to, we're going to like, dress you up in bandit publishing apparel. What? Next next uh, next episode, so I want to look in the, in the brochure, and you pick out whatever clothes you like. Okay. And we're going to get some fat logos here. And what, what can we expect next time? Because we have to give the viewers a reason to come back. So one thing for sure, we always do our dynamic stretching in the lot of work. What is that? What does that mean? A lot, a lot more oh. technicalities. Like, so, touches. And... Oh my okay. So, obviously, soccer consists of a lot of things. It could be dribbling, ball control, passing, receiving, shooting. Um, so, it's a lot of things. Could we get a goal in here and maybe practice shooting? That would be awesome. I have bugs. I have many. I don't know about shooting, but we can do Maybe like we can kick in here, like. Accuracy. And, yeah. All right, cool. We'll do that right up here, or in the basketball court. All right, we'll do it in there. It was open last time I came. We can do it there. Okay. Okay. So I, I think the ladies also right now what's big is glutes and abs. Can we like do some exercises to get ladies to have like six pack abs and glutes? Can we do that? Can we work? Can we, we can try it. Okay. Cool. Because I need that. All right. I. Oh my God. Oh my God. Show it. It's an embarrassment. And everybody else has a six pack except for me. So if you guys can help me to get a six pack at 52 years of age, I'll buy each of you a Rolex. Each of you. <laughs> All right. So um, thank you so much. And, and we're going to be doing one of these like maybe once a week. All right, cool. Awesome. Wait, can we like, obviously you're going to cut this part out. Can we throw the ball to the camera? Yeah. Kind of like, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Kind of yeah. like being like the dumbest person. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no. You I'll catch it. I'll catch it. Yeah. <laughs> awesome.